I'm going to show you how to add a checkout page and a cart page to your WordPress website after you've installed WooCommerce. Now, if you don't know how to install WooCommerce, it's really easy. All you have to do is download the plugin and add it to your website. I'm going to assume that you've already taken care of that, so we're going to jump on ahead. So, step one. Uh, adding a, a checkout page and cart page, the process will be the same. The only difference will be the short codes that you use. So for both of them, what you'll need to do is go to pages, and then you're gonna create new pages. So I've already done that, and I'll show you what they look like. Here's my cart page and my checkout page. So let's go ahead and edit it. Now you can call this anything you want. Uh, I'm calling it my cart, but you can call it anything that you wanna name it. Uh, once you make, once you name it, you'll. This is the short code that you'll use. Bracket WooCommerce underscore cart uh, bracket, and then you, this will say on the right side where it says update, it'll say publish. So you'll need to publish that page. Now, if you're looking to make a uh, the checkout page, same idea. You'll make a new page. Call it anything that you want, and the short code that you'll use is WooCommerce underscore checkout. And on the right side, make sure to push publish. Once you've made those pages, you'll go down here to where it says WooCommerce and then select settings. From settings, you're gonna to wanna to go to checkout, scroll down and select the pages that you've made right here in this drop down option. So cart and my checkout page. Then after that, just select save changes. And if you go to your website and you select carts, you'll see that you have nothing on your cart. You'll need to add some items, obviously, but now you do have a cart page. So you can go back, return to shopping, add a couple items to your cart. So we'll do that, and then we'll do your cart. And here you go, here's my cart page. I have something, and then go to proceed to checkout, and you can see that you have a checkout page as well. So that's how you do that part of it. If you wanna have this cart option in your menu, you'll need to update your menu over here. Uh, I'll show you that real quick, because it might come up. All you have to do is find the page that you made, select it, and then add the cart page right there. Uh, depending on what type of WordPress template you're using and theme, you might have the option to add icons. So you can see here, that's how we have that cart icon. I hope this video helps, guys, and if it does, please give it a like and a share. Thanks.